All right, Jameson, come on in. Jameson Montgomery? Yep, that's me. I see you've come to work wearing a blanket. It gives me good luck, sir. Okay, look, you've been with us for five years. Yep. And in that time, you've stood out in no significant way. Yeah, I suppose not. And then last week, we've got it on record that you put beans in the drawers of every single person on your floor. Is that correct? Yeah, I might have done that. Why? I thought it would be funny. I'll, I'll just go and pack up my desk now. That took balls, Montgomery. Huh? To pull an alpha move over everyone you work with. Filling their drawers with beans. Baked beans, I'm assuming. Yes, sir. You took initiative that day, Montgomery. You wanted to do something and you did it. I need men like that on my senior team. What are you saying? I'm saying, Jameson, I want to make you one of my senior advisors. Sir, I put beans in everyone's desk. You had an idea and you executed on it. I need more people like you at this company. I've also been stealing things from the office for years. So you'll do what it takes to make things better for yourself. You're a go-getter. I save my poos so I can do them at work and I don't flush. You're mischievous. A lot of people don't have a good sense of humour in this business. That's what we need. What I'm describing is disgusting. And the fact that you would tell it to your own boss. You're so sure of yourself. You don't care what people think. I slept with your wife, sir. Sleeping with your own boss's wife. Is there anything you won't do, you scoundrel? How am I not fired? You'll go to lengths that others won't. That's a unique quality, Jameson. So I'm a senior advisor. You're my most senior advisor. So does that mean I get more money? Your yearly wage will increase by a factor of 20 and you will receive untold benefits. Shit, that sounds alright to me. All I need now is for you to sign this form. Jameson, you son of a bitch. I bet your love is gone.